Hey everybody, it's Ann Beebe. Today is um, Thursday, December 20th, 2018. I'm Barb Hammer, and I am in St. Augustine, Florida, at the St. Augustine Lighthouse and Museum. So this is uh, an old museum. I don't think, uh, this is an old lighthouse. I don't think it's actually a functioning lighthouse anymore. Uh, I don't think the Coast Guard is using it anymore. So it's sort of a Coast Guard museum. And it's in a beautiful area, very lush, very lush uh, tropical area, St. Augustine. Uh, it's the old, oh, actually the oldest, the oldest uh, continually settled uh, European city, I guess, in, um, in the U.S. And I think in Canada, I think Quebec City is the oldest city, European settled city there. I've been to Quebec City. It's very beautiful. So the Spaniards, uh, came here in the 16th century. And I'm going to look at this sign here. So I really love the grounds here. It's very lush. And uh, so, yeah. So this is the museum, lighthouse and museum. This is the sign. I'm not actually going in. It was kind of a rainy day. It's let up a little bit. But um, I might come back tomorrow when the weather is better. Um, yeah, so they have a museum and you can take a tour of the grounds. They also have a ghost tour here. That's very interesting. I noticed there is a ghost tour you can take of St. Augustine itself. So I think those are very popular. I took a ghost tour once decades ago in Harpers Ferry, West Virginia. That's where John Brown and his men uh, tried to start an uprising just before the Civil War. Anyway, that's another story. But I like the, the grounds here are very interesting. You know, so there's, you can see the base of the lighthouse. This lighthouse actually reminds me, it, it's the, the stripes on it are like um, the Cape Hatteras, North Carolina lighthouse on the outer banks of North Carolina. And that's where my family used to always go on vacation. Look at these trees. Just incredible, the growth here. Beautiful. I don't know. I like the plant life here. It's very tropical here. Yeah. So Florida is in the tropics. And I like this little uh, this parking lot. It's uh, sort of a sandy. It's not paved. I like this kind of parking lot. It's not paved. It's uh, like it's sandy. So they ha actually have Christmas lights. <laughs> so there's it's Christmas time here. So they have they put Christmas lights on that building there, the museum. And uh, maybe I'll I might go on over. So the ocean is just over nearby. Maybe I'm gonna take a little walk over here. Yeah. Um, if not, I might hop in the car and just move the car over there. But I think the ocean might be just over there. Not sure here. Oh yeah, well here's the sign to the entrance there. And uh, yeah, very interesting buildings here and the trees. Sorry, the light is probably not very good. I've noticed uh, it doesn't show up very well. The tablet, yeah, the light is not. So it's just dripping now. But it was pretty steady rain here before. Okay. So, hang on. I gotta rearrange things. I'm. I got a lot of stuff I'm carrying here. Anyway, so. Yeah, there's a lot of parking here. So there's not a lot of people out today because the weather wasn't so good. 
But I'm glad the rain has let up a little bit. I decided to get out. I'm staying an extra day here because the weather did not cooperate. Look at these trees. I love this kind of plant life. Yeah, okay. So I'm going over to this parking area and see if I can get a glimpse of the ocean. I'd like to see the ocean. Yeah. And it's not cold, you know. That's what I don't mind about the rain here. It's warm rain, so I'm used to, in the Pacific Northwest, the rain is really cold, bone chilling cold. Okay, so that's not the ocean here, but there's a little boat launch over here. That's neat. If you hear some clanking, it's the chain, chain, I mean the keys around my neck. Sorry, I have a lanyard. Uh, oh. Okay, okay. Hey, this is nice. Yeah, there's sort of a yacht club or something, boat launch here. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe that's the yacht club, I don't know. I'm just gonna walk over to the boat launch. I just wanna see the water and the boats. Oh yeah, oh yeah, these guys are bringing their fishing boat. They've been out fishing, I guess. And they're putting the boat back on the trailer. Yeah, so this is like a little uh, uh, protected inlet or something here. Yeah, so the boats, oh, a lot of sail sailboats here up on the shoreline. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at all the little shells. Yeah, those are shells, tiny little shells. Those green things and the black, they, some of them turn black. Or no, there's, oh, it's a mix of, I don't know, interesting. Tiny little mollusks or something there, something, I don't know. Or maybe they're plants, I'm not sure what that is, that's interesting. Okay, yeah, here, so here's the shoreline. So the, I don't know, like all these palmettos and things tropical. Yeah, so really lucky with the weather. It's just dripping right now. But it was really just pouring down. Oh, yeah, here we go. You can see the lighthouse better here. Yeah. I love lighthouses. They're beautiful. Very striking. Yeah. Okay. So, mm, I can smell the water, the, the sea salt, the sea water, the salt, salt water. Yeah. I like that smell. Yeah. Yeah, there they are. So, that's the St. Augustine Lighthouse and Museum. So, uh, I'll talk to you again soon. Bye.